Hi everybody, it's Kitty Chris here playing today Fran Bo. I apologize if things sound a bit off and differently. I'm trying out the equipment I had put away for a while. Um, last place we took off, we were at the stairs. Let's see what happens. I What did we have? I don't remember what we had. Uh, I apologize for not having a recording up yesterday. I was out um, with another YouTuber and we were just working on a project together and I realized that I did not do a backup recording of any kind. Okay, so we have the key, the paper, a picture, and the crayon, so... Oh shit. If you struggle, you will know that it was I. I will be in every corner to make you suffer and pay. If you choose to disobey, your cat's life will be marked. Wow. Why'd you have to go at my, my Mr. Midnight? He's so cute. Why would you go after Mr. Midnight? Oh, my dear kitty. We will soon be together again. I promise. I miss you, my dear. I miss you so much. Kitty! Why are you leaving? Please don't leave me alone, Mr. Midnight. Amaze. At the end of the maze, Fran. Oh look, they're little crescents. I will find you, Mr. Midnight. Okay. Oh my god, that sounds like that sounds like a grandfather clock. Okay. I fainted again. I wonder if my dreams are true. <laughs> the monster won't let me go home. But if I find the maze, maybe I can find Mr. Midnight. Well, I love your positive attitude. I don't think anything's changed. Well, let's... Can we go back down? Ah! Those, those look like, um... Those rooms, like, when you just go crazy. Oh, I know it's an asylum. I know. By which... A moth that will dance on the floor. A moth that will dance on the floor. Okay, so obviously nothing's working out. I apologize if you hear, like, little movements, little noises if things sound louder than they are originally supposed to be. I'm waiting for my pop filter to come in so that way it can block out some of the noises. Um, okay. Patient- oh wow, operating room, there's nobody here. Um, Robert Clark, psychosurgery procedure, lobotomy. Dr. Roman Bates, observation failed, anesthetic- wow, the patient woke up after reaching frontal lobe- oh my god. The procedure was canceled and incompleted. Wow, that's... Oh, that's so sad. That's super sad. So what about these? There's no papers or anything. Oh no. Oh no, poor girls. I hope they get well soon. That's so sad. Okay, let's, let's check this one out. Oh, hello. Are you resting? Um, I don't know, little girl. It looks like he's sick. So if we open these up... <sighs> I am so scared of these pills. Oh, wow. They're, is that a clown? Is that meant to be a clown? Why is there a kid? My path to life has been denied. You can't blame those who are ignorant. No, you can't blame those who are ignorant at all. Oh, poor guy. Okay, so what if we check? Oh man, with this thing, I can hear- it's like an echo. It word. It word. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> oh man, I'm losing my mind. Yes, I took the new one upstairs. Franbo? No, I haven't seen- I haven't seen her. What? The key to the cellar? Well, no. And the doctor's office? He used to have the key there. Calm down, the key is not here. Sure, I'll let you know if it turns up, but you must calm down. Yes, I'll bring it to you if I find it, alright? Bye. Alright. Oh my goodness, I can't believe this. I'm at the reception already. This is grand! It's just grand! Okay, so... But the nurse! I have to get rid of her. What should I do? Oh my goodness, I can't believe this. Okay. Okay, so...
at the end of the maze. Wow. Thank you for telling me that. Um, why do you have a piece of string around you? Oh, you're all skinny. Yuck. <gasps> oh my goodness, are you okay, little baby? Does it look like the baby's okay? What kind of 10 year old are you? I'm very curious. I can't remember Angrace's number. Oh, a love letter, dear Pete. Ugh, gross. Okay. Well, you, ugh. The key holder has no keys to hold. Or is there? Ha ha ha. Okay. Um, use. Can we put the key here? Yeah! And there you go. Hope the nurse sees the key. Wow. Okay, so let's just. There we go. Oh, the key was here after all. I better take it back. Hurry up, woman. Hurry up, woman. Okay. Okay. I can't remember Angus's number. Okay, I'll just surprise her when I get home. I can't open the door. It's locked. Okay. Um. Oh, 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 the paper, the paper, the paper, the paper. Examine the paper. Let's see what it says. Dr. Marcel, turn off the alarm from the security system panel in the reception. The yellow door will be re remain open for two minutes until the alarm reactivates. Alarm code December 17th, July 25th. So 25, 17... 825 oh it's a four digit oh man okay so that's not that's okay so am I gonna have to do math I don't have a pencil and yes I can't count off the top of my head because my memory is so bad my brain got really bad recently okay December December 17th so 12 plus 17 that's 29 right 12 I must have 29 29 and then July which is 8 wait May, June, no, seven. Seven, because my daughter is in June, so that's six. So if it's the next month, which is July, that's seven. So seven plus 25, five plus seven is 12. 32, 32, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 12, 32. Yeah, it rounded off, it's 32. Okay, so <laughs> I don't remember, 29, 32? 2932. 2932. We're gonna try it. Yay! I'm the best! The very best! Yes, I wanna pat myself on the back for that one. Took longer than it probably was supposed to. Okay. You little bitch. I will make you pay for what you did. I just put you to sleep. That's all I did. Oh, oh my god! <sighs> you clever little girl. Do you think you can just leave? Oh, I'm sorry. Don't take me back. What? It can't be. No! Wasn't that when I took pills? And where's the guy? I need to get to the maze. Okay, I'm super confused. And he's alive! Why is he following me? Oh my god, what's happening? Don't follow me, you rapist. Okay, so he was in my dream. He was when I took the pills. So if I'm already seeing him, like, wide awake, so am I, am I losing my mind from those pills? The sleigh looks pretty good. Oh, I like this little paper thing they did to her. Ah, ah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean I didn't mean to be in your way. Aha! Aha! Yes. I beat you to it, Mr. Kitty. No. Oh, Mr. Kitty, well played. You beat me to it. 
I'm assuming to follow him because Mr. Midnight is my follower, but he's made out of wood. Okay, so if I am seeing him, like, in reality, then I have officially lost my mind. That's what I'm assuming anyways, that I've lost my mind and the pills. And we also saw the guy come out, but his head fell off and we were trying to be dr and we were uh, being attempted to be dragged back to the asylum. So I think I would like to think that taking the pills I've oh crap 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 I'm assuming I've lost my mind I'm losing my mind slowly as I take those pills more and more. Yes <laughs> I did it. What are you doing? Okay. At the end of the maze, you will find a bunch of scary things. The critters of the night, of course, critters. They will haunt you, they will laugh. But there will always be a good side. A cat full of nuts and bolts, which is not Mr. Midnight, yes will always be your guide. Nuts and bolts. My picture? That's so sad. We had to leave that picture behind. So we didn't get back, go back for it because I assume curiosity symptoms. Curiosity does kill the cat. Oh no, does the cat die? Is that like something? Okay, I'm thinking too hard on it. Oh my goodness, that was close. Indeed it was. Where am I? I hope the guards don't find the sewer. You can come out now. Oh, what is this place? I hope I find Mr. Midnight soon. Indeed. Oh, the instrument is pretty. Ha <laughs> ha, I remember something funny. Well, what was it? A very old uncle tried to blow on one of these. Ha <laughs> ha. I don't get it. He farted all his gases out because it was so hard to blow. <laughs> well, that is pretty funny. Aw, Teddy doesn't have an arm. Your arm is gone. Good thing you're not bleeding. Well, he's fake, so. Mr. Midnight, are you in there? Can I open it? I guess not. Uh, thank you for answering my door. What about my answer? Door. I know a story about a girl with red shoes, and she had a dog. Do you mean Dorothy? I think Dorothy- yeah, actually the, the movie was about the thing came out around that time. What a pretty horse. I bet the midnight will like it. I think that's what it said. Cause that's not scary at all, right? I know when I take those pills something's gonna be there. Cause that's just too ominous? Is that the right word? What the hell is that? An ant. This ain't James and the Giant Peach. I just, I think we've officially lost our minds. <laughs> what if I'm allergic to you? No. Let's see. Oh wow, you're a really big ant. Who's there? Oh excuse me, sir. Are you real? Ah, oh, you always ask me the same thing. Always. Always? What do you mean by always? Of course I'm real. Where did you come from? Oh, I escaped the mental hospital, but please don't tell anybody. I won't. Don't worry. But what are you doing here? Real bad things happened to me, sir. But now I'm looking for my cat. Hmm. Cat, you say? Yes, sir. A black cat. A very big, with very big yellow eyes, Mr. Midnight. Oh, I see. I, I am sorry, girl. Oh, so you haven't seen it? It happens to be that that cat, that the cat is eaten, chewed and swallow. Eaten? What do you mean? The black cat that came towards me in a hurry. Okay. I catch it. I give it to my beetle pig. My beetle pig is hungry. Oh, my Poor dear beetle pig hasn't had any food in days. The blueberry time has passed, and we ate them all. You should probably try and save some. Stop it, can't you see? Mr. Midnight is the only one I have. 
please tell me you are joking. Oh, little girl, don't cry. I can sing for you if you like. What will I do now? You don't know how it feels to be alone. I do know, yes. I am the last one alive. Let me help you. Yes? How could you possibly help me? The digestion is not fast, you know. Not so fast, you know. Maybe he's still inside. Alive. Inside the beetle pig. Should I do something? Like make the beetle pig vomit? Kill the beetle pig! He is also the only friend I have left. But I need the meat. I'm curious to know if my kitty is still in there. Do it! Kill the beetle pig! And I, Antonio the Greatest, shall eat the meat. Wow. This is gonna be really interesting. We are totally willing to kill a beetle pig. Oh, an axe! Like, cuz... <laughs> in case I need to axe you? Oh, question? That is the worst pun I have possibly have ever done today. Or in my life? Aw, oh, an owl! That's so cool. What kind of bird are you? It's an owl, but it's a but it's like a golden owl compared to like the Harry Potter one. I don't remember his name, and I don't want to know. <laughs> I used to be a Harry Potter fan. You look like an owl. Is that what you are? Probably, child. Let's pop them pills. Okay, this is not scary at all. Oh my god! <laughs> I take it back. I take it back. I'm sorry. Oh my god, I'm hearing the voices. And this is like put up to a loud volume that I can't, I can't. I'm gonna lose my mind. Oh well. Oh my god, wait, 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 wait. I don't know what's happening there. We have an axe. We have an axe. Can I just, can I just, can I use it? Can I use it? Can I use it? Can I use it? Oh my god. Mr. Owl! You dropped a feather. Oh, a feather. Tickle, tickle. I'll keep it. I like it. Wow. I'm being really cheerful today. What a bluff. There is no hole in here. Wow. Well, that's interesting. So what's happening here? Nothing. Please don't have a shadow pass by me. Wow. Okay. Okay. I feel like watching The Nightmare Before Christmas right now, but I'm not. Curiosity is damned! Damn you, curiosity! Oh, I like to be curious. Otherwise, how will you learn things? But what are you? What you are kind of curious yourself. What's the right question? But why should be more important? I don't have time to chat, sir. I want the key, that is all. Oh, but that key isn't ours, and it's not yours for sure. It's always good to have an extra key, especially when you're up to something. We couldn't care less. The affection towards you is simply none. You are very honest. I like that. I am a person. Fran, nice to meet you. Interesting. Tell us more. I have a cat. Well, I had one. He's missing now. I have to find him. Really? Yes, really. Now please give me the key. Look, person Fran, we came from the south. Flying as always. Mm-hmm. And one of us got curious about this key. And all of us got stuck here. That is sad. And because of our long hair, we can't get loose. So, you were also curious, can I help you? We usually get stuck on trees, but we always have something to fix that. A beautiful comb to comb our hair every time we get stuck. Give me the comb and I can fix you. Yes, because we're going to be nice enough, you know, a trade for a trade. There is a problem. A filthy thief took the comb. Now we are stuck forever! If you find the thief in the comb, you will have the key. Deal? Yes, but what does he look like? Just that he's filthy. It's a rat! A filthy narcissist rat! He took the comb to be beautiful. Well, maybe he wants to look beautiful. We couldn't do much, so he ran away with it. Please find it and free us from curiosity. I hope he hasn't gone too deep in the forest. I'll find him. We'll be here, waiting. Okay. Pretty. Ugh. I got a shiver. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> you look heavenly. No, <laughs> I'm sorry. I just wanted to be friends. Oh god, I hear the whispers already. 
I am going to ignore them to the best of my ability, but they're not as loud compared to when we were... Oh my god, they're louder here. I take it back. I take it back. I take it all back. Um... Okay. So let's see what we can do. Let's see what we can do. Can we kill the beetle pig? Mr. Beetle. Mr. Beetle Pig. Do you have my cat? Mr. Beetle Pig. I can't kill Mr. Schnoobles. I'm gonna call that pig Mr. Schnoobles. Schnoobles. Wake up! The pig won't stay still. Yes, I can't wake up Mr. Schnoobles. I can't keep Mr. Schnoobles alive. Alive. Can't keep him still. You know what? We'll try that right now. Uh, Mr. Schnoobles. Come here, Mr. Schnoobles. My little beetle pig. You're so cute, Mr. Beetle Pig. I just want to kill you and eat you and just get my cat back. <laughs> Mr. Schnoobles! Just stay still! Talk to Mr. Schnoobles for me, sir. Okay, you didn't want to talk to me, so I'm assuming you're asleep. Tickle, tickle! Tickle, tickle! Tickle, tickle! I'm never doing that again. No, my bad. Ah, the threat is great! Great! <laughs> Oh, sir, wake up now. I think the beetle doesn't like the idea of being killed. Oh, I see, but that is completely normal, isn't it? Yes, but what should I do then? You should give him the special berries. The blueberries. Hmm. I see, but where do I find these berries then? I shouldn't say this to you, but I have the right connections. They live inside my house. They have blueberries. My house is in that direction. Be careful. Oh, thank you, sir. Okay, guys. Well, I'm going to cut it off here because I don't want to make it so long as I did the other one. And I still have to edit it. Whatever. But, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, so, we're leaving off where I have to kill Mr. Schnoofles. And yes, I'm going to say it like that. So, I hope y'all enjoyed this video and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.